Veterans Day that we are honoring our veterans. We are very proud to have with us one of our celebrated veterans, Jack McNair, who spent 28 years in the Air Force. We'd like to welcome you to CBS 42 Morning News, and thank you for your service. Yes, thank you. I appreciate that. And to talk to me, sir, about the significance of this day. This is very important to all of us veterans because it does give us all a chance to come together and celebrate uh, what we've done, what we've accomplished, and we're all just proud to have served our country and anything we can do and help our veterans that are like myself that uh, we're getting up in age and all and it's uh, we just go out through the whole state and help who we can help. Yes, that's right. In about 70 days our commander, our new commander in chief will be Donald Trump and one of his campaign promises was to do more to, to help better care for our veterans. What could our next president do to help veterans? What more can be done? Well, one of the best things is uh, more help in the hospitals uh, because they have a great program they're doing now in the hospitals, this choice program. You can go, you can, uh, if you can't get seen right away, they send you to a specialist outside of the VA hospital. You can get more programs like that because we have a lot of veterans that are having to wait so long to get the care they need. Yeah, we're looking at some video of our, our president-elect there when he was at, at the White House yesterday. And during the campaign, he talked about his 10-point plan for, for veterans. Among them was creating a private White House hotline for veterans that would be operated 24 hours, actually with a live person on the other side to answer any complaints that, that veterans may have. What kind of support do veterans have right now? We have a lot because there are a lot of organizations around town like your VFW, your American Legion, uh, Blue Star Salute, which I'm the president of. Um, they can call any of us and we have contacts with all the organizations that they can help them. Yeah, talk to me about your Blue Star program. What's that all about? Yes, we, are, we formed uh, 13 years ago and we traveled the state of Alabama honoring veterans, past, present, and fallen heroes. We also have our photo board, which we designed. It was designed and we travel with it. It has all of the pictures, almost all of the pictures of all the Alabama's fallen heroes since 9-11. Yeah. We show that to people to try to educate people that these people gave up their lives for you. Yeah, they did. And we want to thank you for that going out to the Veterans Day Parade today. Absolutely. Absolutely. I wouldn't miss it. All right. Again, Jack McNair, thank you so much for your service. Thank you, sir. We certainly appreciate you being with us. Thank Send you. me back to you.